Hi, I'm Bing. Here's how to make a VR chat map faster than I can roll this blunt. VR chat's weird, and it's filled with weirdos that make weird shit. Luckily, normal people, like you, can learn how to make normal people shit, and we can start having fun again, because this game is potential. I almost threw up when I said that. First off, you're gonna need Blender, Creator Companion, Unity Hub, and Photoshop. Blender is what you're gonna use to make your models. Creator Companion is how you're gonna manage your SDK. Unity Hub is how you're gonna get the engine. And Photoshop is what you're going to pirate. Because we don't pay for things. Download the Unity version you need and create a new project with the world's template. Organize your stuff too, because you don't want this headache. Then, we're gonna go into Blender to make a cool room. Blender is an eldritch beast of its own, so I can't really teach you how to use it if you don't know, but here are the most important tips. Extrude will will extrude a face, subdivide will subdivide a face, loop cut will create a slice. You can set materials by going to edit mode and setting it by face. And for UV unwrapping, either do smart wrap or box wrap if you don't want to think about it. If you don't know, a UV map is like unfolding all the faces into origami. You're also going to need some textures after this. I get mine from Ambient CG, but you can get yours from wherever you get yours. We're going to add some mesh, some lights, a skybox. <laughs> I might have done a little too much, but that's like half the fun of doing this shit, so. Now, we can add Udon scripted objects, like chairs, mirrors, other things. Udon is great, because it sucks. You can either do it visually, or code. And one of these, a robot will do for you. Is it ethical? No. Are we playing VR chat? Yes, so who cares? An easy way to get chairs is to steal them from the example file, and then just move them to where your chair is, and hide the chair model. Same thing, works good enough. For mirrors, uh, just, again, steal it from the reference file. Go to the builder, name it, take a picture, describe it if you feel artsy, and then upload. I know this is not a comprehensive guide as some people probably need, but this is more of like a just a rundown of my process, more than like a step-by-step -step guide on how to do all this. This is what I do, done it a couple times gonna do it again. Tune in next time when I host a rave on an underground subway system. Oh, and use code back with save 10% on gamers up, bitch. I'm like Tyrannosaurus Rex. I sense movement, then I got a red shot. I'm on top, I'm down the flip-flop.